One of the things that offensive coordinator Tony Peterson told us this week is they left 180 yards in passing out on the field last week because they were not able to connect on deep balls. They go short there. They've not been on the same page. Last week, Michigan dominated them up front. To Matt's point, Logan Bruss is out at right tackle, and so Bordellini is in for him at right tackle. Bruss is banged up this week. They run left. 14 and a half tackles for loss in one season. First third down of the game, and Mertz is dropping back with a very good pocket, a high throw, rising up to catch it. It's Jim Ray DK, but DK short of the first down by three yards at the 36 of the Fighting Illini. Raylan Allen in the eye, and for the second time, they give this to Chanel. This is third and short, and it is converted to the 20-yard line. There was a third and one just converted. Once again, it's Cundiff and Ferguson as the tight ends, and this is a strong run by Malusi. Malusi still going, powering inside the 10-yard line. Wisconsin looking at first and goal now. We'll call him Quad Martin. Throughout today, second on the team in tackles. Now a field goal attempt for Colin Larsh. Probably will be a lot of Ches Malusi and Braylon Allen, who we've seen. Maybe some Jalen Berger. Chanel carried actually a couple of times as well for Wisconsin on that 18-play drive as Isaiah Williams ran out of a tackle. Matt. 2-12 to go first quarter. Malusi cuts it back into a ball. Oh. He runs over Kirby Joseph, one of the things Ryan Walters, the Illinois defensive coordinator. Time expiring game winning field goal and the upset win over Wisconsin two years ago. But right now, the second quarter starts with an interception. Kirby Joseph, a turnover in five straight games for Illinois. Two fumble recoveries, three interceptions, and Illinois stops the Wisconsin drive. And Ryan Walters, the D coordinator, said best energy guy in the world. They really feed off that. But here's a big hole, Braylon Allen. Allen going low as Kirby Joseph to stop a touchdown. Including that fourth down and shorts. Now Braylon Allen. Allen on this play for the 19-yard line with a stiff arm of Kirby Joseph, and Joseph hangs on. With second and goal at the one for Wisconsin. Chanel, he is hit by Sidney Brown. He's leaning, he's in, touchdown. They have been on top of their game. Brown with a burst. Brown with a run. This is just the second time this year that Wisconsin has allowed a rushing play of more than 10 yards. That starts at the 22 and ends up, let's see where they spot it. His total numbers. Running play inside and spinning and bouncing. And another first down picked up. Braylon Allen. No day at the beach for Illinois because of the blocking that has been done by Wisconsin up front, their ability to run the ball. And they're running it here. Malusi, and Malusi is running it in for a score. Just bounced off a tackle, and Wisconsin, on a 15-yard touchdown run, is up the lead. And the, the players weren't even around when he was, when he was coaching. Graham Mertz throwing and completing. He found Kendrick Pryor in a soft spot in the defense, caught it at midfield. It has the Illini 44 before Kirby Joseph tackles it. Illinois has not been able to get anything. Motion, jet sweep, Shimray DK, and DK is hit but stays on his feet after the initial contact. Down to the 36 yard line. Jet sweep run by Shimray DK and then the conversion by Brady Shipper. So you spread it around, you spread the wealth, and now Braylon Allen running the ball. Oh, and it squirts out at the end. Is he down or is it in Illinois? Fumble recovery, it's Illinois ball, the indication right now. Wisconsin's given it away 14 times. Wisconsin is minus 11 in turnovers this season. Let's see whose power and strength shines through here. Oh, it's Malusi, and Malusi with a burst to the outside. First down and more picked up. Outside the 40, spotted down to the 45. You start looking at him. So, Selsner's done nice, Tipman's done well, Nelson done well, and Gordon and now it works to throw, and it's Kendrick Pryor with the catch. And then the ball came out at the end. Looks like it's a completion, though, and a catch and down as Sidney Brown upended. Works now 9 of 17 today with that completion. Allen. Wait for a hole to open up, and it does. And it will open up to allow him to run all the way in for a score for Wisconsin. And you can see it in his teams. They have great discipline, and they have... Uh, they have the right personnel in the right spots. Like Noah Birch just now, who came in and blasted. Dane went for seven. 
This is the farthest that Illinois has driven down the field today, and they'll have a snap in Wisconsin territory for the first time. It will be at the 35-yard line. Final seconds winding down. There's linebacker Jack Sanborn and Paul Christ of Wisconsin now two and three and one That's and two of the, of the Big game. Ten. It's a win. Wisconsin 24, Illinois nothing. <laughs>